Hey guys, it's Tech Geek Gaming back with another video. Today we're playing Trove of all things. Guys, like, what's Trove? Um, we'll find out shortly. How about that? I'm level 10. I should really go to the level 10 arena. But I'm gonna go to 8 and 9. So, what Trove is, it's basically like a multi online massive multiplayer with mixed with an RPG adventure style kind of game. So, I mean, it's pretty fun, in my opinion. It's pretty easy to unlock characters. You can spend money if you want, and you don't have to spend money if you don't. So, I mean, that's what I really like about the game. And it's easy to level up characters on the early stages. And instead of, like, um, some, you can't really change how your character looks. In Trove, you can. And you can get really cool upgrades based on the gear you get from beating bosses. So, here, let me just demonstrate. I'm at level 10, and I'm going to go... See, like character level, and you have a mount, so you move faster, and you can fish and stuff like that. But, like, um, let me just go in here, and they every character has their own in unique special ability. So, mine, I jab with the spear, and then I can plus mouse button two, which you guys see in a minute, to deal a ton of freaking damage to my opponent. Um, they just added PvP, which is really nice. I like it personally because you're not just confined to that normal. Oh, I'm gonna go out and venture. You actually get a little more action in the just that, which I like. So, I mean, maybe you guys don't like it, but sure enough, I do. So I'll be playing this for a little bit. See, so you can also play online with other players, and it's pretty easy to. Um, get new uh, mounts and stuff like that because I mean um, yeah what do I mean um, they give you chest every day for you to unlock which is pretty neat and pretty different from all those like uh, cube world which I don't think has been updated recently I mean it's been updated but I don't know recently I'm just gonna get rid of you get out of here I can't find it for you guys but I'll go do one did you find it did you if you did good for you okay, there's like 20 people here so I'm like going away alright so let's just do um, let's go to this boss one out in front how many Okay, so it should appear on the map any second there. So, which is nice. I like this. So, you can just find these mini bosses right here. So, let's just say this one. Boom, boom. and Okay, that's mouse button 2, which deals a l large amount of damage. And I can do multi-hit with my spear. And sometimes, so, mouse button 2 again. Then my hit by hitting keyboard 1, it basically puts up a spike wall and shoots out a... A wave where I can um, defend myself in close range. Two, I'll show you a little bit later. But every time you defeat like a mini boss or a boss, um, you get uh, so much loot. So they have sometimes portals to get to the next world or the the boss. So I just have to find them. Probably in here. Yeah. Or stairs, one of the two. Um, so yeah, and this is cool. Hold down space, you can just kind of glide. So here's the boss, or I think so. I don't know. One of them. It's a dungeon, and there's also recipe dungeons. So I'll show you guys that a little later. So here's mouse. This is two. What? It didn't activate. That's that's weird. Okay, here. So if I hold down a mouse button one, it deals damage, but it's also taking health away from me. But the cool thing about this is once I get to a low health, it spawns a little guy, like a ally that will fight for me, which is pretty cool. So this is why I like the Reverend of all things. You guys like Reverend, really? But I mean, there's tons. Here's all the classes. Just tons of them. They each have their own special abilities. So, um, this, the Drake, I don't know how to pronounce that. But with 
this character, you can shoot fire and turn into a dragon and also throw bombs that blow up. Pretty useful. One of my personal favorites, the boomerang. It can do a bow or a meal. Um, sword, something like that. And then you can throw a boomerang to basically stun um, opponents, which I like because then throw it at the boss, throw a bomb, you have a bomb and then basically a mystery bomb. And it can do anything from damage to split into multiple bombs. My favorite, it spawns three chickens and they will destroy anything and everything. It rocks. So this is so um this is what you get from beating the higher bosses is a red chest with sometimes better gear. But I didn't get that much because I'm playing on a lower level. So let's just go back to the hub. So by doing that you just press H, hold until it teleports you. That's pretty simple. So once you're back here, you can go to your club world, which you have, you can join clubs, here's the PvP area. And here, I'll go show you the recipes. Okay, so recipes are, you can earn them by doing multiple things. And you have a cornerstone, which you build on. And that's like the weirdest cornerstone ever I've seen. Just like, this is mine. Scaffolding, pretty cool. And what I really like is, so, if I get off my mount, and I go down here, you can, all these, these are trophies from fishing. So, I've gotten a silver trophy from catching a silver, silver violet trophy, and I also get other trophies and stuff. And I built things. And so, if you go over here to your workbench, every recipe that you unlock, a little slow today. Um, please don't lock. Up. Thank you. Really, you're gonna do this? Okay, so you unlock recipes based on the biome type. And so I've unlocked. Let's see, what should I make? Um, Dragon Fire Beast. Here, this is one of my favorite. Um, hmm. Stack credits. So, what you need is these crafting materials. But I'm not gonna make that. I'm gonna make this queen, for example. So it costs that much, and I have all the right materials. So I hit craft, and then, as soon as it refreshes, I can hit tab, and it's automatically there in my inventory. And I have some um, trophies to hang up. So battle trophies are from defeating high bosses. And here's my little queen from like a chess game or something, and there it is. So. so by I've also gotten recipes for the pool table and that that the turret the chicken the tank the pedestal and I can't remember what that is but if you go up here I've also got crafting recipes for the lantern the chicken the fence the dog the mat the painting the um, oh I can't remember what it is the chest and the stand these are standard. You just need the right level. But one of the cooler things I like that I've collected, which you get off the start, but they're pretty expensive to make, are their upward drafts. And what you do is you they you can sail on them with your wings that you can deploy with by holding space, and you will go extremely high. So let me just get down here, and they look like this across on them. They almost like snow and then once I hold my wings I can just go so as you can see I'm just flying up so once I'm up here I can just sail all I want and by doing this you're not holding down space you're just gliding and then A is left D is right and W you just kind of go downward fast I mean you can just let go and it'll deal damage but I mean it doesn't do a lot. I mean, only about a fourth. But I mean, you earn it back with high, um, um, health regen things. And the cool thing is, what I like to do is go into the portals, and you'll um, still have your wings on, and you'll just literally just keep on flying, just keep on flying. Woohoo! Great maneuverability. 
pretty darn on fast. Guys, so if you guys are playing it and you're watching this video, um, you're like, how did I get the new bike from the Chaos with a Chaos Factor of 4? I don't know. Second day, I got this out of the chest. Don't ask me. I'm not the one who coded the game. Okay, lead me. Come on. Thank you. I just follow persons half the time. I mean, it's like, okay, yay. Oh, close. Okay, where do I go? Down. Just keep on going down. With half of these, this is how it goes. Keep on going down, down to the ground, like we all do. Okay, do we have to go back up? Because, I mean, there's no way out. Okay. See, that's the... I don't remember what that is, but come on. Are you going anywhere? Nope, I'm going to find the way. Um... I think we're supposed to go up. Up. Keep on going up. And I think we're supposed to go this way? Yeah, I think so. Wait, is this it? Yeah, E? Yeah, this is it. Okay, now, sometimes they're hard to maneuver because you have no freaking clue where you're supposed to go. And half the time, I get lost halfway through them and I don't know how to get out. So I just keep on wandering. Um, until I eventually find them. Is this just going to be repetitive? I think it is. We're going this way. You're coming this way. Okay, this is, this works. So now I'm just going to play. Um, kind of give you guys an overview of what Trove is and what it does. I mean, are we just going to go in the circle? Because E-Portal. Gosh, yeah, it is a cycle. I have no clue where to go. Because that kind of guides me, that big castle up there. Better than that, it doesn't really do anything. Um, let's just go this way. I hope I can find my way to the boss. If not, I get the XP from them killing it. Um, and then you can see that like there's a um, kind of like quest over on my side that if I do this, I get this the um, um the thing. So, oh, what's it called? Um. the thing I don't really um the dragon soul or whatever yeah what's it starlight dragon soul which can be nice and useful I'm just you guys okay let's just do this I'm just gonna burn to death. okay let's just go back to the hub sorry about this guys I kinda got lost told you it happens to the best of us um controls for fishing let's just because I get this a lot I I was actually stumped and I had to go do a little research before I figured it out. Um, to fish is F. I know that. So, why I hate this. Sometimes it spawns me in different world. Sometimes it doesn't. Are you guys... This is the easiest way to get out. You guys like use magic find. Yeah, I know. But if you look here. Status. Magic find is that. Okay. So, but I have this activated. Yeah, see, well, really? He always follows me around, so. Him. Did you guys really get out? Really? Wait for me! Damn it. Can I, like, teleport to you? What's the teleport command? Yay! I found it! Activate crystals right here. Okay, now let's go. Go, go. Kill them all. Kill them all. Boom! Killed ya. One. Gets rid of all ya. Boom. Oh, two. This is two. They get in close proximity. It will just deal damage to all of them. Boom! See? Pretty easy. Hard to see sometimes, but yeah, it's worth it. Oh, yes, I may have found it. Yes, is it down here? Yes, I found it. Hey guys, we found it! Yahoo! See, I think it's this guy. Yes, it is. Is it you? Is it you? Boom, boom. Let's go. I'm gonna die. Lovely, I lost 50. But, if you guys notice, 
I have 48 before. I'm only down to 200 because I have 200 plus. Love it. Are you going somewhere nice? Because, come on. Hurry up, game. Generate your world. What are we after? Ooh. Um, let's just go this way. This works for me. You see those, like, the scrolls almost? They're called recipe dungeons. And what you can do with recipe dungeons is that's how you get new recipes to craft with. And I like that because, I mean, it isn't your standard, like, in Minecraft, you can only craft this, this, and this. But you have a free reign of build. Here, you have a limited build area. But you can craft a lot of cool things. Um, for instance, you can get a ball. Literally. You can craft a ball that you can bounce around the lobby. It is, it's just fun when you get really bored, guys. Go craft one of those. And you'll get those, like, tw uh, five game game of soccer if you craft a soccer ball and it's pretty unique are you doing my recipe dungeon just don't I want it my recipe dungeon my recipe dungeon did you really just take it did you no my recipe dungeon thank you it's not done yet slay the Shadow Knight. Um, these are pretty easy to do if they don't have one of those, like, this guy doesn't have a power. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Summoning things from Really easy. Just take them out. Just take them out. Boom. It gets really close proximity, but, I mean, Q, get my thing. Boom. A few hits. And, literally, you really just show up for the final. I hate when people do that. Then what you do is that in your hotkey R. So I got a bench left section or in section, same thing. Um, but yeah, so you see what I mean? It, you just defeat them and you get a new recipe. So these are probably the easier dungeons. They really guide you. So you go down here, boom, jump across, dodge you. This banquet hall open this because then I can get some stuff go boom kill ya can you come over here and fight me fight me spear 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 what the where are you boom boom one boom boom one The enemies won't kill me as much as oh, I hate that. Those little like more things that are like boom, 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 and you're like, what the? Adam, I mean, they get really cool. These guys sometimes drop really good stuff. He has the same class as me. Yay! No, nothing good. Let's go. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. And I do have a club, guys. It's called Tech Geek Gaming for You Club. If I'm on and you guys are on and you guys want to join it, it does have Shadow Tower. If you guys are looking for a Shadow Tower club, it does have a Shadow Tower um, on it for you guys. So, I mean, that's always good to do. I mean, that's what I do. For my boomerang, I have tons of great gear for that my character now because of that. See, makes it really easy. Boom. Close range, and you're almost done with this. I mean, they don't, like, oh, I hate this sometimes. Boom. Boom. See, it just takes out most of them. How many? 20? Half the time, I don't even... There you go. Boom. Kills most of you. Kills most of you. And then my guy... 20 enemies? Really? And they just keep on spawning. No sense. No. Really? A relic spear does less than my legendary spear? Okay, that makes no sense. Because it goes, I think it goes common, rare, legendary, relic. What? Okay. B, let's see. <gasps> I got this? You guys are like, what's this? And then it goes shadow level one. 
Oh, uh, no. Then it goes... Resp I don't know how to say that. And then it goes shadow. And then it goes... Um... Um... Oh, what's it called? I don't know anymore. Um, but I'll show you guys. You're like, what do you mean by you're so hot? But if I go here, I'm going to switch to my boomerang class. Um, you guys are like, what do you have equipped for him? This is my boomerang class. Weapon, I got this from the Shadow Tower. Shadow level 3. Physical damage, pretty good. That's pretty good. And then this, I just crafted because, what the heck? And you guys are like, where's your banner? I don't have one at the moment. My allies, okay. So you guys are like, what that thing in my inventory is worth? Okay, so let's put my weapon up here. I need that to to upgrade this. So, um, I'm going to upgrade this. Hopefully, I can do it. So let's just go. Three, two, one, upgrade. Okay, what are, what's it like? Okay. Can be modified at the chaos swords. And this is three or more, which is nuts. And what did I get? Okay, so I think it upped the, critic, the critical hits with it. So, um, and it has to be shadow. I don't like that, but go here. I do have a dragon coin. Guys, look, how do you get all of these? I've been playing for a while. How do you have three, two shadows? Because I feel like it. I just feel like it. Yeah, one, two, three, symbol. Yes. Um, now we're going to go to shoot shadow tower. So if we go F1, P, Techie King for you, club. I'm the leader. Woohoo! Stops. I I played this in like in fifth grade, and so half of them I just got back into it recently because I've heard they gotten out of beta or whatever. Okay, so they reset it. So I need one shadow key. So the really tab. Okay, sorry guys. I have they reset it, so I have to go make a new shadow key. So. Let's go. Once I make the shadow key, actually, I'm thinking I'm just gonna call it at the shadow key, and then next time we can do the um trial, whatever that is. So let's just go find an empty plot for me. Boom. Boom here. Go over here. Pull club. Am I in the wrong one? Yeah, I am. Over to your adventures, Shadow. Oh, I don't have enough, so let's just go to you. Shit, I hate this. Shadow. Come on. Work. Come on. Come on. Okay. I'm not going to get it. I'll have to go earn it. So, Techie Gaming out. Next time, we will be doing Shadow Tower. Guys want to know what it is? Check out my next video. It's up after this.